face forward in particular uh, really helps women heal on the outside so they can heal on the inside and that is so important because I, I this is my first time speaking publicly about my own instance of domestic violence after eight years you know and I had bruises that were easily covered with makeup but when you've been slashed across the face or burned with acid or worse uh, that doesn't go away and you need to have some help from doctors and that's really expensive a lot of these victims don't have those resources so a company like an organization like face forward that actually does this all pro bono it's such a worthwhile cause. I'll be presenting the award to Gloria Allred tonight, who's helped countless women or countless victims of domestic violence, actually. And, you know, it's really, it's such an honor for me to be here. It's, it was a little nerve-wracking, to be honest. It, this is the first time I've ever really talked publicly outside of my own home about my experiences, mostly because people tend to judge. People tend to, and, and I've gotten to the place where I don't care anymore. I want my story to help somebody else. Why do you think that women are in an abusive relationship? Why do they keep going back and they know that it's wrong? They don't know it's wrong. <laughs> I, I liken it to being turned by a wave in the ocean. Do you know which way's up? No. You're all over the place. All you see is bubbles. You don't even know where the heck you are. You have been turned around so much to the point where you don't even know what's true anymore. And I've been asked a few times what to tell someone who's out there dealing with it. And the first thing I say is you're not crazy. You're not crazy. When you're a victim of something and it's not considered okay, and it's something that people don't like to talk about, you just constantly spread this feeling that they're alone and they can't tell anybody. And it needs to be spoken about and brought out to the forefront so that people don't feel afraid and they don't feel alone. And the more we talk about it, the less it'll happen. Can you tell everyone at home, you know, what the reason was behind you starting a great foundation like this? Yeah, well, my first uh, boyfriend in Scotland was abusive and uh, I had to actually leave the country to get away from him. And then all these years later, I met my husband and uh, we started a great cause. Absolutely. Now, how do you feel knowing that big celebrities are, you know, supporting this cause and now more awareness is being created and a lot of people are stepping up to the plate? It feels uh, great because when I speak, people will listen, but when a celebrity speaks, they really listen. Yeah. And that's what, you know, they have followers and fans and that can stop a lot of uh, young men becoming abusers. Personally, I think that women probably make better uh, heads of state, they probably make better CEOs, and our society still treats them like second-class citizens today, 2014. Right. You've got to be kidding. And I think a lot of people, you know, they think that if you support domestic violence that you must hate men. And I love men, I love my husband, but I don't think a man should be an abuser. Yes, um, well, for the people watching, if you know my YouTube channel, it is the cover that I just released, and um, I'm not going to say the act, exact, exact song, but um, it's about a widow, and uh, it's a pretty popular song. <laughs> yep, yep, you guessed it, you guessed it, Black Widow. <laughs> thank you, thank you, I'm excited too. Um, so congratulations on not show. Can you just tell us um, if you think that your own personal character resembles the character that you're seeing in the show? Oh no, not at all. The <laughs> Carlito is a uh, he's a he's a terrible human being. The character that I play, I am far from that, or I like to think so anyway. Um, but that said, it, it's fun to play a character like that. To to go to very dark places to talk about things that you know we. That, that I don't talk about at all in real life because it's you know I, I'm not a drug dealer I'm not a you know involved in human trafficking and all these terrible things yeah. that Carlito gets into but the ironic thing about that is as dark of a subject as subject matter that, that the show dove into this this season it helps bring awareness kind of like a cause like this tonight you know to a certain negative aspect in, in life and so we did a whole thing mid-season when the big storyline of human trafficking was going on. Serena Swan, who's a big advocate against human traffic, trafficking, was involved in, in, a, in a movement uh, mid-season. And, and again, doing a show like this helps bring to light something like that. Um, charity, charitable organization like this helps bring to light the, you know, the, the need for an awareness and the money to help those that have been victims of domestic violence. 
you know, domestic violence is something that it doesn't matter what your background is, it doesn't matter what race you are, what religion you are, how much money you make, what your cultural background is. It transcends all of that. It's going on all around the world. There's one in three women experience domestic violence. One in five children are being brutally abused. And it's something that... You know, I, I thank God that we're finally starting to talk about it. Exactly. But it's a big issue and we have a long way to go. It's great that we're here tonight meeting people that are strongly against it and are actually doing something to help these women, men and children who are victims of domestic violence. Um, I think it's an this foundation, Face Forward, is an incredible organization, and I'm so excited to learn more about it and meet all the heroes that are here tonight. I came out. I came to the event last year, and I felt like I was totally blown away by the people and their stories. And I, I think it's a, a great organization, and I feel like the work that they're doing is wildly important to shed light on domestic abuse and to give people help that otherwise wouldn't have it. It's really changing lives. I'm Viviana Vigil, and you're currently logged into Entertainment Scoop.